and this is Ferret's Dream. <laughs> Today's episode, we will be diving into a strange phenomenon that is Pharaoh's dream. So, Pharaoh, tell us about your dream. Two days ago, I had a very, very strange dream. Here is a reconstruction of Pharaoh's dream. grassy banks of the River Nile, seven unusually <laughs> plump cattle are grazing peacefully. Moments later, seven skinny and aggressive cows <laughs> emerge from the water and side up to the original cows. There is not much of a fight as the skinny cattle savagely devour the others. <laughs> Surprisingly, the skinny cows do not grow in weight. With that, the encounter is over. Now for an ad. I was very confused. There are some very wise men, Joseph, son of Jacob, and Phil Lerman, the son of Pete Lerman. <laughs> <laughs> so, Phil, what did you think of the dream? Thank you, Phil. <laughs> so, Joseph, what happened from your perspective, and how did you interpret the dream? Um... Farah, what? Farah, <laughs> called me to inter interpret his peculiar dream. So I prayed to God and got taken out of prison to talk to Farah. I told him that the dream meant seven years of plentiful harvest and seven years of famine. So Farah, how did you deal with the situation? I needed I needed help to organize the food, so I hired Joseph as second in command. Joseph, how will you manage the food? I will store the food in the barns and make sure Egypt has enough. So, Phil, what did you do? Thank you for joining this episode of Pharaoh's Dream. 